Um, Star Road. Very funny. Alright. Onward. Um, so, where shall we go, folks? Where shall we go? What have we not seen yet? I don't like that one. Seen that one. I don't even fucking know what that one is. What the fuck is that? Okay, yeah, we're just going random, folks. Ah. Alright, so we are on the Jungle Japes map, and already coming out hot are the Samuses. They are laying out some big old blasts, big old blasts. It is a dangerous land of thought. Um, but this should be good. Samus on Samus action. That will maybe keep them busy tonight, and we won't have to worry about uh, them. There is a super scope on the map. Star Fox is currently kind of working out a little bit. Everyone is at level 9, and Star Fox immediately falls off the map, so that is one death for him. Uh, but coming in with a little hit. He seems to have been a little bit... Uh, who was that that just died? So someone died? No one died. I thought someone did, but it was just a uh, sound. Um, so Star Fox, again, down to three lives, and Samus down to four lives as well. Rab is sticking out strong, 140 damage. If you get in that water, it just seems to be instant death. So is that the end of Star Fox again? Star Fox, what are you doing, bro? Just figure out your shit. And that is Samus off the map as well. Sheik sitting at... Star Fox, what are you doing? Um, the Samuses are 100% going after each other, and he has got to be so careful. He is down to one life. Can he stick around? Sheik slash Zelda is doing a fantastic job at 197 damage. There are no, um, figure your shit out, and Sheik is off the map, and Star Fox is out already. Space Ozzy, the fuck? I'm so sorry. That might be the quickest death we've seen so far. I have no idea. Apparently, foxes know, do not know how to swim. So we have Giggle Muffin sitting at pretty high damage, getting pretty damn, and then Rab getting hit pretty hard by um, another Samus. And we've got Sheik back on the map, and gets a big old hit. Everybody's got Star Rods. And that is Giggle Muffin's down to three lives as well, and a big blast from, from uh, Lady Zelda there. Lady Zelda. So she is sitting at 86 damage, four lives left. It is all to play for, folks. This is so much... This is a much closer fight than what we saw last week. And coming in with some chic action. Z Samus on Samus action. Is Rab going to be able to survive through and go move on and continue his onslaught of points? Or is Giggle Muffin Samus and Sheik going to hold them off? Sheik is off the map. There doesn't seem to be as much a uh, side... Side? Um, I thought that was Link. The, I mean, it is always Link. It is Link in a in disguise. You know how that works. So everyone down to three lives right now, sitting on this precarious platform. I am so terrified of that water. Anyone gets in it, I think they're just instantly gonna die. It is an absolute miserable time for everyone to be had. And she does lose out and goes down to two lives now and comes in with a big old blast on Rabbis. I just thought that it's funny. And that is Rabbis off the map, and Gigglemus is still here. That sounds like uh, Santa Claus's really fun uncle, Gigglemus. Or, yeah. Anyways, so we have everyone down to two lives. Oh, Sheik just loses herself in the music and, or actually in the water there. And it is all to play for. She has one life left. Can she stick around? Or are the Samuses, the possibly o OP Samuses, going to move on? My money, it, I will say that they are not very effectively utilizing many uh, projectile weapons. I will say that much. That there has not been that much going on of that. And she does stay on the map. Can she stick around though? She is at 93 damage. It is looking kind of dangerous for her. But coming in with a big old hit. It is all to play for, folks. All to play for. Oh. I am just, like, in awe. This is such a close fight. And Rabbis is off the... is out. Not out-out, but he is down to one life. So he is just a mistake away from being eliminated in round one, which is a... which would be unheard of at this point, folks. Is that that is the end of Zelda? And it does appear that the Rabbis and Gigglemus will be moving on. So congratulations to you two. 
uh, a fine fight by everyone. So, I don't know if Space Ozzy is in the chat tonight. Um, if he is, he definitely wants to stick around and let me know who he would like to handicap, either positive or negative. So unfortunately, Mal and Space Ozzy, you have been knocked out in round, round one. Congratulations to Giggles for moving on to round two. We have just a good old Samus off. And that is the end of Samus Rab. You have moved on. Very close fight. If only Space Ozzy and his Star Fox could have done something. No offense, Space Ozzy. We love you and thank you for participating. So for our kills tonight, we have Rab with only one kill. So that's, um, yeah, so, Ooh, my heart is like pumping from that. That was a great fight, guys. That was an absolutely fantastic fight. Zelda, or Sheik, sorry, Zeldeek, nope, that doesn't sound right, um, coming in heavy with seven kills, and Star Fox, you got one kill. Um, oh, it is, it is, isn't it? And I've got to do, actually, let me see. Okay, yeah, let me fix that really, really quick. Hold on. Um, I'll put... I'll just put that up there then. That. I'll just put that over here. Whatever. That's fine. Um, one kill ass. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Perfect. Okay, so... So one, so plus three and plus three. So let's get our bracket updated. So congratulations to um, Rab and Giggle, Giggles. Um, so let's get our semifinalist one with, and actually I've got to consult something. You should have seen the look he got when he said that. As per, all right, so. Okay, so Rab, you have gone for round two, you have gone Bowser. So I'm remembering all this shit, guys. So let's see. Giggles, you went with, I believe that is Mario. Yes, that is Mario. So Giggle Muffins Mario. It is not copy-paste, bro. I can't copy-paste because remember, there's three different fighters. Yeah, so. Yeah, so let's get our second round going. So we have, in round two, we have, I'm so excited for this, a Stairbender Game & Watch. That's gonna be so fun. Um, very excited for that. And then we have Gur with Kirby. Um, very excited about that pick, if I can find the right one. Gur so we got Gerby, we've got Mark with fucking Ness, um, and Link. So we'll get that one, and then I just gotta find wherever the fuck... This, so this like ready thing just like completely messes with my head. Oh, Star Fox needs to be Ness. Down with stare, my, you know, do you, you gotta make some enemies there, Rab. All right, so this is our round two fight. As you can see, this stuff is a little bit borked, but who the fuck cares? Cause I certainly don't. Um, oh my God, Scoot Scoot. What is this type? It's, ow! Scooter just bit me. And yes, I did the little Charlie voice. Um, alright, so, in true fashion, we do need to go to the Jungle Japes. So, good luck to everyone here. I believe we have everything all set and ready to go. So, here we go to the Jungle Japes for a fantastic fight. I am not very familiar with Game & Watch's moves, but they are all over the place. Link, this could be a disadvantage as he is a heavy boy. Um, Kirby getting in some Link powers. And coming in with a big old down B. Gotta love that. Gotta love to see that. You know that's one of my favorite moves of all time. This is a... Oh my gosh, what was that? That was insane. I don't even know what Game & Watch did. That was a great smash. Literally a smash. Unfortunately, it did cost him a life. And Kirby goes for the nasty grab. What a nasty, nasty grab that was. There is definitely some action to, to, to highlight and to watch here. Kirby, stay on the map. Don't let yourself get absolutely borked. They are just coming out with their 
fist firing and everything. They love this little map. They love this little spot right here. I have no clue why. It seems like such a bad idea. It's so small and so tiny. Kirby, you bish, indeed. What a great fight. All to play for. Game & Watch is down at three lives. I'm not 100% certain how that happened. Is Kirby going to get back on the match? He does. Is that Link's first death? He is such a big heavy boy. And Ness goes down in the water. Forgets how to fucking swim. Those, that water is just so terrifying, by the way, folks. Oh, is that a death to Game Watch? He does get back up on the map and gets curb or Ness absolutely blasts Link. Absolutely fantastic. Oh, coming in with some Star Rod action. Is that the end of Game Watch? He sticks around 173% damage, folks. Is he going to get back up on the map? He does not. I don't even know what happened there. I don't know how he failed so hard on that recovery. It is not looking so hot for the stair, the stair bender, the stair and watch. And Kirby is off as well, down to three lives. Ness, oh, that is game of which I wonder if maybe you just cannot get above, if that, that first, that platform in the main area is just something you can't like get above. Like it's just, it's a solid roof, wall, whatever the fuck you want to call it, a floor. And Ness is down to two lives as well, folks. Link is just, Maybe committed Harikari. And that is the end! Stare! You have been eliminated in round one. You went with an awesome pick. I was excited to see him. The map was a little bit unforgiving at times. And we have a fantastic fight. It looks like we might be seeing Ness getting a nice little kill right there. Um, I mean, we all know. And I mean, he's going to be back. In the OGs. Um, next week we do have our team tournament. Ness! Ness went down as well. So, yes, you cannot actually get... That is so evil of this map that you cannot recover there. That if you get under there, you are just borked. And the AI probably does not do a very good job of that. So, congratulations to Long Smash and... Gur, you are moving on. A fantastic fight. I'm excited to see what map we're going to see next. Um... Yeah, yeah, I am so excited. So we'll go over that uh, stair, and you can definitely um, put in your selection. Link coming out strong, though, folks. This is a great first fight. Um, so Kirby had asked... Very interesting that Kirby didn't have a single kill, but Kirby, because Kirby definitely did a um, amazing move where he grabbed him, launched himself up, launched himself down, and killed himself and killed the other guy, but that apparently did not count as a kill. I don't understand how that works. That, I think, is stupid. Um, so we have Lonk with five plus three, because that's three for moving on. Um, I think that's, yeah. Um, we all know who he is going to pick. I'm going to shut off my internet, BRB, lol. Um, all right, so Stare, two kills. Kirby with zero, but plus three for moving on. Mark with one kill tonight. All right. Is Space Ozzy in the chat? I don't know if he is. Let me look and see here. Um, I got to check. I'm going to check some stuff out because I need to check because I know I made a rule in the modifiers for this that if there was spitting. Fr so we have a modifier called spitting from the grave. So first eliminated gets to handicap a player by plus one or minus one or those people can collectively handicap one player by um plus two minus two so i know stairs in the chat he was first eliminated so stair who would you like to either benefit or hurt with at least a plus one or a minus one i mean i think i know exactly who you said you're going to uh but i just want you to put it in chat so and while you do that, I'm going to get everything. Let me just check and make sure. Okay, you want to hurt Rab. So we're going to give Rab a minus one. A minus one on his... Um... <laughs> I don't know who else is in chat. Um... But let me see. Uh, I got to get stuff updated anyways. Let me just check and make sure I got the kills. Uh, plus. Okay, so everything. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Um, so let's get this updated. So, like I said, we have semifinalist three. We have Gur. 
Seven, four, three, and she has gone with a Pikachu for round two. Very, very spicy, spicy choice. Um, and then Long Smash has gone with Kid Link for round two. Um, so here's the thing is, like I said, I never received a, you know the rules. I never received a third submission for um, Long Smash, so we may be giving her a random character or a Jigglypuff for the final round since I never got that. I never agreed to that rule at all. Um, so, okay, so let's get our shit updated. Let's go to our... Okay. Um, is this round? It's a round two fight. Okay. You don't have to, just part of the culture. All right, so... Here's what I'm going to do. All right. Well, so here's the thing. Space Ozzy is not in chat, and I don't have a um, secondary form of, like, if of doing random things. So I'm going to sit by my rule and say that since that person is not here in chat participating, that um, they're not going to get to submit. So you're only going to get a minus one handicap grab. I will give you that because I'm not going to be as much like, you know, I'm not going to say it because I want people to win. I want people to participate, but I do think everyone wants you to go down. No offense, but you've done a fantastic job. Absolutely fantastic job. I'm going to give you only a minus one. We can't get Space Ozzy. If he shows up beforehand and wants to donk someone, uh, we can do that. But um, right now, so we have Rab with Bowser. Let's get this update. Giggles with Mario. Rab has Bowser. And like I said, Handicap is at four. I mean, I don't know if Mal's in chat. Uh, she might be busy. She could speak on Space Ozzy's behalf if she wanted to. I don't care. No, I'm joking. Um, who else do we have? We have Long Smash with Kid Link. So Young Link, sorry. And then we have, who else was it? Um, my brain. Uh, Gur with Pikachu. Let's get Gur with Pikachu. All right. So this is your, like I said, so we're gonna leave that at a handicap of four. Still is a disadvantage. Um, still can be all to play for folks. So here we go, on to our next round. So in traditional fashion, it is going to be on Brinstar, Planet Zebes. This is gonna be very interesting and maybe very bad because of the knockback effect. That can happen to um, people. I am very, very excited to see this. Mario, we haven't seen. Young Link, we haven't seen. Pikachu, I don't believe we've seen. And I think Bowser, we've only seen with the Pessimist play. So this is all to play for. I also am not super familiar with all the things that happen in this map. Bowser is off for his first death. So maybe that handicap is going to play a big factor here. We will find out. Link coming back down, getting a little slicey slice in. This map is looking like it's losing its... Oh, that was an abs... Oh my gosh, Bowser just got yeeted. This is going to be so powerful. Um, the, the fire is going to absolutely decimate people. Bowser is currently down to three lives, folks. And comes back in. Oh my gosh, that just... That was a, that was a saucy play by that, by that fucking sauce down there. That was evil. Them's the plays. You knew that you would be a target for this one. I was not familiar with this map and how destructive this fire is. I mean, I, from what I understand, that five handicap is supposed to be basically zero. Like, there's, it's one way or the other. So, neither, like, I don't know. Mario finally down as well, down to four lives. We have now everyone at four and Bowser. So I've been mostly paying attention to Bowser, the turmoil of Bowser, but gets a nice little kill right there. And it looks like the fire is coming back in. Does he stay on the map? Does he? He does. A beautiful recovery. Um, and that is Kid Link out down to three lives as well. Oh, and another death. Bowser down to one life. As they said, no three-peats. But I can't speak too soon. We've seen a, we've seen a beautiful Star Fox come back from like so much death to absolutely stick around and win it all. Um, staying on the map though, he's just gonna outlast someone else. Maybe Bowser isn't. Maybe he's very hollow in that shell. Um, he's a big hollow boy. But I don't know. 
and he is getting bounced around like crazy. This Pikachu is no joke. He got a little star rod in his mouth, and he's booshing people around like crazy. Fantastic recovery by Bowser. Is that Pikachu dead? It is not. Mario is coming back. Everyone's coming back and getting blasted. I love the sound of the Bowser spin, though. It's fun. Mario, again, sticking around, and Bowser is out. Well, Rab, I know you're probably not feeling too great right now, but you put in a hell of an effort. You had a great run. Oh my gosh, Pikachu going down to two lives as well. Young Link down to two as well. This is going to be all to play for. Who's going to stick around? Is Mario going to survive? Does not. My god, this fire is absolutely brutal. Um, this is a map that is being so fucking evil. Get in the sky! Get in the sky, Pikachu! Stay in the sky! It is bonkers how powerful the the fire is here. We may see some... We are going to see some new finalists here. It could be Gur, it could be Lonk, it could be Mario. Oh, Mario! Mario has been defeated! It is a fight of the sisters. My wife versus my sister-in-law. The acid is broke. I will 100% give you that. The acid is 100% broken. Um. So like I said, um, I might need to send, after this, I might need to send a message to, who's gonna die first? Congratulations to Young Link. Rab. My gosh, what a, Stare. 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 Is that a quote five? I'm not sure. Oh my gosh. Absolutely brutal. So round two. Oh my gosh, I was like, I was like, oh shit, I don't have like the, oh, okay. Um so round two we had Rab. Rab came in, we got we got three kills though. Mario got three kills, and Gur got five, and Lonk got five. All right, let me send a... Yeah, so I've got those KO points, so I'm gonna check and make sure that that is true um, to what everyone needs. It's a good thing we're not doing KDs, like kill-death ratios, because everyone would be fucking borked. Like, everyone would be just, like, not doing so hot. Um, all right, so, congratulations. Let's update our bracket. This is gonna be a fun final. And here's why this is, oh, no, not that bracket. Um, and here's why this is going to be a fun final. First off, it's Gur. And guess who Gur went with? She went with the Jigglypuff for the finals. So I'm very excited for that. Very excited. Um, yeah. And, so here's an unspoken rule. If you don't get a fucking submission in, you get a Jigglypuff. I think Stair and I may have talked about this as a, as a, as a lull a long time ago, but here's what's happening. Don't have a pick, you're getting a Jigglypuff. So, she's getting a Jigglypuff in the final round if I don't get a pick from her in like the next like minute. <laughs> we might not have. I was probably just throwing her under the bus there. Um, but either way. It's gonna be a great fight. This is gonna be a hell of a fight because uh, it is a jiggly off. A very, very rare jiggly off. Oh. So. so get your jigglies out because this is gonna be a wild one. I hate it when I make myself laugh stupid at my stupid jokes. I don't hate it, but like, why the fuck do I laugh at my stupid jokes? Um, wait, what the fuck? Let's do... 
Oh, I. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I have no idea what happened here. So for some reason, you so I'll get that tallied up after this. So for some reason, it's kind of something's happened with my little uh, some of my shit here. So we're just gonna we're just gonna I don't know. I'll fix it later. Anyways, you're gonna see the standings once I get to those standings. I've got to update it. Um, so we have. Uh, put that back up. I'm gonna dunk that out, dunk that out. So, like I said, we have a fantastic Jiggly off. Now, should we do this in really interesting style and knock up their handicap to nine so they are just gonna have a fucking slap fest? I think that sounds fun as hell. I think this is gonna, that that would be fun as hell. I don't know what you guys think. Uh, but if I slap that up to nine, it is going to just be a bitch like slap fest and that that's gonna be funny but I don't know what do you guys think you will see the standings after I get them tied I'm not doing I'm not updating the, t the standings live like I will do that right after this is over with. I guess you guys are not giving me much choice so just for the hell of it yeah we're gonna go with big handicaps big handicaps folks it might just be you two watching, so I appreciate it. Um, okay, we'll leave the handicaps. But we're not going to Planet Zeebs. If it's Z, if it's Planet Zeebies, we're gonna we're gonna nix that. Cause I want to actually see these two fight each other. Um, also, that handicap looks like it's more than that handicap, which is a little bit upsetting. All right. Is there a Pokemon map? Let's go to Pokemon Stadium. We're gonna go to Pokemon Stadium. Um, oh, this slot, anyway. Yeah. Slog. Oh, I'm so excited for this. We're going to Pokemon Stadium, folks. So, good luck to Log Smash and Gur for an absolutely fantastic slappers only. Look at this. Look at these slaps. This is like fucking Rocky versus Rocky right here. Just slapping each other around. 69. Very nice. They do not do a ton of damage. It's gonna be so much fun. Oh, you hear that? Just psh, psh. Oh, the the round humanity, poke manity. Oh man, I don't even know who's doing who to what now. I'm not sure who is who because they don't really change colors. I gotta figure out. I believe flower one is is Gur. I believe that's who that is. So we might, it might just be an absolute mystery until this fight is actually over, folks. Yeah, you're probably right about not putting on the, um... I thought Pokemon spawned on this map. Do they not? Interesting. I guess they don't, which is really, really shit that they don't. Oh, puts her to sleep and then goes in for the throw. Might we have a first death? We do with a down B, folks! A beautiful down B by, by, uh, I believe, Gur, Gurpuff. To knock down, oh man, and a big ol' slap. I love the Jigglypuff face. This is some big, this is gonna be such a close fight. Such a close fight. You gotta love seeing that down B. It's so rare to see the AI use that, but it is so powerful. Um, not really sure what just happened there, but, uh, some issues with clipping in the map. Oh, we do actually have a new, um, land or whatever. Um, fuck, I hate typing on my phone. I, I get that. Yeah, no, I know. I'm so happy you guys are watching this on the big screen. It cracks me up so much. Oh, puts her to sleep! Go for the downbeat! Doesn't, gets the, gets the gun and goes blat, blat. Oh, but does, I think, get a down B right there? Not 100% certain. Getting a big old grab. Such an even fight right now. And just a, a headbutt. I mean, is it, isn't is isn't a Jigglypuff like just a head? Like all head? Take that however which way you want to. There is an item on the map. There is a weapon on the map. Man, this is some absolute edge guarding. I have not seen this kind of edge guarding in a long, long time. Absolutely brutal. 
It is so even of a fight. This is what you come here for. So current leader, guys, is Jigglypuff. In case you were wondering, the current leader is Jigglypuff. And that is, is that, that is Lonk. Lonk Puff has been knocked into oblivion and down to three lives. But sitting at a little bit better stat with the 100, with not being at 132 damage right now. What map are we going to see now? Oh, some more edge guarding. We've got a little uh, windmill. That's a windmill. That's what that is. Man, the edge guarding on this map is so beautiful. You just don't see them implore those kinds of strats, and it's so good to see. And Gurpuff is down to two lives, folks. But coming out, and man, a very interesting death. Not 100% certain what happened there, but was definitely um, an, an equalizer for sure. Using the Star Rod effectively. Look at that little, like, swath of hair or, or whatever. Oh, that is... Gurr, you are down to one life. One life and a jiggly dream. Oh, gets a beautiful grab. Going for that. Going for those grabs. Going for those beautiful, beautiful grabs. And now getting edge guarded. Edge guarding like a real boss. And both getting booster on. There are two guns on the map. Oh, she falls asleep. And she wakes up. And she rolls. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's asleep again. And she wakes up. Oh my gosh. The back and forth. But she has one big jiggly headbutt away from death. And that is it, folks. That is it, folks. Congratulations. Wait. I was wrong. <laughs> I thought... I don't know who died. <laughs> But we do have some edge guarding going on. It is going to be very, very difficult for Gurr to pull herself into this. The sleep does not last long. That is 100% certain. It is like a mal, a maladitor night of sleep. That's for sure. Is that the end of, of Gurr? It is not. Come back in to get slapped around again. Is that the end? It is not, folks. She's coming in with a little kick action. This grab. So Lonk does not have the flower, Rab. Lonk... That's Gurr who has the flower. It is wrong on the screen. Something borked. Don't worry about it. Congratulations to Long Smash on your first victory. First victory and congratulations to Gurr making it to the finals. Stopping the three-peat. A fantastic jiggler. Jiggly off. Loved it. Absolutely. That is just pure Smash Brothers action. So let's go with our finals. So we had Gurr with three points and we have... Lonk with four, and I've got to check the rules because my brain, I haven't done this in a while, so I don't fucking remember exactly how, how many points everyone gets. <laughs> uh, when the final is five points. So Lonk Smash. All right. Gets those five points. So congratulations to Lonk. I don't know if she's in chat. I don't know if she tuned in tonight, but you did it. It was amazing. Um, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it on my stream starting soon. I'm going to give you guys another fight while I tally everything up. Okay. So, all right. So I'm going to do that. And I'm going to tally stuff up and I'll be back in a few minutes. And then we're going to start our, um, we're going to start our shit. Okay. All right. Thank you. 
All right, guys, welcome back. So we're gonna get to our um, the rest of our evening pretty soon. Um, later tonight, after I do my speed run, I will be getting into um, who I'll, I'll be getting into next week's combat. Um, so next week will be a team fight. But here are the current standings. We have Rab still sitting in first place with 60 points. And I'll show you the breakdown of, of how tonight went. Um, we have Stare, close second with 57. Long Smash made a big old move. Getting 49 points total. Um, I almost feel... I, I For some reason, my brain is not thinking that that math is 100% correct. I'm just trying to look through. So. I was not right with this math. I just want to... I don't think something's updated right. Something is definitely not updated right. Here's what I'm gonna show you. The so week one we had Blanc with eleven points. So write that down. So eleven points plus then twenty one points. So then puts her at thirty one points. And then week three she had twenty five points. So twenty five plus eleven is thirty six. Less than yeah, something's not right. That math is not right, which really pisses me off. Because what if all my maths aren't right? Let's see the total for. I'm gonna be right here. So total for Rab tonight was seven, right? One, three, and three, and you were previously at. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah, let me share this with you. If you want to fucking... Uh, shoot. Um, can you send me your... Oh, I'm just going to send it to your... Um, so, yeah. You're an editor. Yeah, if you can just check it, because I know that, that number's not right, but I think everything else is probably right. It should be. Um, yeah, I can see if I can find out the jank, because I know that I have it set up that it's supposed to automatically update everything. But if I look at, so like, if we look at totals for, totals for Rab, so week two you made 30 points, week one you made 23 points, so you're at 53 points. And then you got 10 points, so something's off here. Some number is off. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Mark's number's correct. Yeah, let me just take a... I did send it to you, Stare. Let me just see here. So let's... If I... Oh, shit. I... I think I... Okay, so... Let me see. I think I... Oh, 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 ah, what the fuck happened there? You do that. I think I know what happened. And why did that move out of place? I think the order is not right. I think I know what's going on. So I need to order this Z to A. There we go. Okay, that is correct. I believe that is correct. Yep, 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 yep. I just need to... I fixed it. I just 
have to do some other finagling it. Um, so basically what I had done was I had not, I had ordered, I had sorted the number, but I didn't sort the number corresponding with the name. So yes, so those numbers are all correct. So Rab, you're at 60, Lonk, you're at 57, Stare, 49. So Lonk made a huge comeback. Awesome. Okay, so I'm, I'm much happier with that. Um, that looks better. So just so you guys know, week four will be teams, and I haven't yet decided how I'm doing teams yet. So um, you did hold on to the lead, but it is very close. I, like I said, I've not decided how I'm doing teams yet. I've got to think about if I want to assign teams or if I want to give you guys maybe team captains, like the top four get team captains. Um, if you guys have suggestions, you can throw them my way. Um, and like I said, later tonight, we will go into the modifiers as well. So, okay. So I'll just have to mess with that. Um, I'd assign them for what it's worth. So you, yeah, so I, I'm thinking I'm probably gonna assign them. And what I'm probably gonna do is just do like a random thing. So I'll give it some thought over the next night. Hi Mal, welcome. Um, you held your own tonight. Um, you had a lot of, lot of kills in round one. Um, things are tightening up. We just saw, uh,